most businesses in the tourist capital have not been spared by the effects of COVID-19, which has led to many shutting down their operations. But for these traders at Mbita Market in Livingstone, they are still persevering with or without business. However, despite slow business operations, these traders are also required to meet their statutory obligation of paying business permit and levies. On this issue, traders at this market have alleged that the Livisa State Council has hiked business permit, saying when the local authority is fully aware of slow business caused by COVID-19. <laughs> Okay, the traders further complain of being charged three quarter market levy even when they have paid for a business payment. Yeah, what, what, what we discovered right now is this. Uh, the shops which are running, which are doing business in town, they just pay the, the trading licenses, of which we are also demanded, which, which we are also paying here at our market, the trading license and as well as the daily uh, three quarter levies which they come and collect. I think it is very unfair because we are doing the same business, the same business which is being done in town is the same business that we are doing here. So we don't understand why should we be paying the three quarter daily levies. I think let the council come up with a program that is going to help us to choose or to pick one that we are supposed to pay for. However, Melvin Mukela, who is Livingston City Council Public Relations Manager, says no one is being charged unfairly as everyone is paying according to the type of business they are conducting. Uh, there are those that uh, are selling uh, tomatoes and others, these small uh, business traders in markets who are paying uh, three quarter uh, per day. And there are those that uh, have shops. So those that have shops are paying a uh, business levy. Or business permit so that's why it is different so they should not compare themselves with a person who is selling uh, tomatoes and uh, this small merchandise and someone who's got a shop to pay the same amount of money so that is where they are seeing uh, a difference and also the other thing is that uh, 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 these uh, uh, fees are categorized in, uh, in areas if you are trading from central business district the fee that you are going to pay is different from one who is trading from a, a compound or a place which is far from a town. These traders are not the only ones affected by the so-called price hikes as it is all markets in Livingstone. Muya Mukombuta, Movitivi News, Livingstone.